If you want Mac OS X's uh, stacks in Windows, then all you have to do is go to the link in the description for this video. Once at the site, click on the download tab and then you'll need to look for 7 stack setup. So click on it and then save it somewhere that you'll find it easily, like your desktop for example. After it's done, you'll just need to run the installer and go through the normal installation process for any software. After it's finished with 7 stacks checked and click on finish, you'll be bought with this. It contains all the little bits of info about it. If you click on preferences, you can change whether you want black text on white background, animate when opening and closing, and also the behavior of how you close the stack itself. If you click on the about tab, it'll just give you a little bit of detail about it. If you click on SF, it'll bring up special folders. These are the most commonly used folders by Windows. And if you click on browse, you can obviously search for a folder that you like to use. I'm just going to use one that I use with Rocket Dock. You can also change the caption and stack type from grid to vertical to menu. And you can also change the icon itself. For this, I'm just going to use the Skype icon since I can find it easily compared to all the other icons that I have. So once you've done that, you'll need to choose whether you want to display thumbnails of images but it can make your experience slower on lower end systems and you can also change the font size and such. So when you've done that, just click on create a shortcut on desktop and from here you just need to drag and drop it to your taskbar if you're on Windows 7 to pin it. You can delete the shortcut after, you don't need it. When you click on it next, you'll be brought with a menu or stacks if you did that containing everything. If you made a stack to a folder then what you'll be faced with is the menu and then if you open the folder you'll see all the files within inside of it. So I hope you've enjoyed this video until next time thank you for watching and goodbye.